The topic of this video is importing linked data to Ninox. We will add to an existing clients table clients that will be related to a certain company. Let's start. We have created a company table with the field name. Now we are going to add another existing field ID for presentation only. When we create records, Ninox is automatically assigning a unique ID and this is what we see here. Each company has unique ID. We need to follow a certain method in order to successfully import CSV file with the clients that will have a link to an existing company. First and foremost, we need to prepare the data to be imported, meaning that our CSV file needs to follow exemplary structure. In our CSV file, we can see several columns. It is important that there is a common key field connecting the company table and the client table. In our case, a common key field is going to be company ID. The other fields are for illustration only. So, in the new clients table, we will have company ID and, as we know, in the company table, we have the ID. They're referring to the same thing. Okay, so the first step is done. We do have a CSV file with the key field. Now we can start with the import. Let's go to the clients table. Let's choose to import data. With our import wizard, we will simply choose our documents. The separator, we know it's semicolon. These fields are for now irrelevant. And yes, in the import settings, we want to choose the clients table and also to import new and updated records. Click Next. So now we are importing data in, into an existing table and we can freely assign which column of the CSV file goes to the which column of your table. Ninox tries its best to make an automatic match by comparing the column names, but you can modify that manually. Note that the table clients does not have a field for the company ID. Instead, there is a link reference to the company table. And now we have to choose the ID and we're gonna map it with the company ID and the most important action is to set this field or reference field as a key. Great. Please let's click next and now in our preview we see all the new entries that are going to be in our existing clients table. So, please let's import. Great! We did it! So, let's recap what we have learned in this session. We know how to import a linked CSV file to an existing Linux table. And we are familiar with the meaning and function of key field that is the most important to succeed in importing linked data. Congrats! Ninox.